Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Because my videos have been kind of long, what I'm going to start doing is a lot of the prep work, um, like painting, um, gluing some of the stuff ahead of time. I'm going to start doing that stuff, which is that kind of stuff right there will be self-explanatory. So what I have done is I took one of these signs here. I took the little heart off, the little galvanized heart from the Dollar Tree. And I had one of these signs here. And I have painted them. I have painted this one. And then I have painted with my plaster Waverly chalk paint. And then this one here, I mixed the Waverly chalk paint chalk paint and some of my acrylic paint together which is the cotton candy i mixed it together to get this color here so you guys stay tuned so what i'm doing here is i'm gluing some of my large popsicle sticks that i got from walmart which i ran out let me go get some more i'm just going these to the back of my two love signs and this is just making it sturdier so that's all I did so I'm going to turn this back over so when I painted this sign here it kind of made some streaks in the wood let me see if I can show you. It made like little streaks in the wood, which I don't mind because it just makes it look kind of rustic. So that that doesn't bother me. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my heart that I painted pink here. And I'm going to put this on here. I'm going to glue this on here. So stay tuned. Hold on. So what I'm going to do here is I got this ribbon. I'm going to take a little of this ribbon. And I like it because it's pink. I hadn't did any of my Valentine's in pink, so I think that's what I'm going to do. Let me measure this out. Okay, so now I'm going to glue this down, and all I'm going to do is just take some hot glue, I'm just eyeballing the, the width between the heart here.
So this is what I have right here. And I'm going to cut this little part off. Now I have some letters here. Some words from a sticker. From one of the stickers from um, the Dollar Tree. I can't remember exactly what it said. But I took, I took some of the letters off certain ones. Off of a couple of them. So I don't think they all came off the same one. But what I have is I have open your heart to love. So this is what I have. So I'm going to glue these on. Well, not glue them on. I'm going to take them off and post them on here and then I'll be back. Okay, so now that everything is on there, and this is what it's looking like so far. Open your heart to love. Okay. So now I'm going to decorate around the edges. So stay tuned. Okay. So what I was looking for was some more of these beads right here, but I guess I didn't have enough. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the uh, ribbon, the same ribbon that I used here, and I'm going to take it and put it around here. And I'm going to do the same on the top as well. I'm going to try to cover up some of these holes, these hanger holes right here. Okay, so then I want to take some of these little um, rhinestones, I guess this is pink. And I'm going to go around the heart with the rhinestone. Okay, guys. Here is number one. Here is my first DIY of the day. And it came out pretty good. I didn't really think I was going to like the pink. Because I'm really not a pink person. But it came out really good. Open your heart to love. Okay, that's number one. Okay, guys. So I just put a little hanger on the back here. And I'm going to leave this to here um, as my only one on this one because I see that I'm running eight minutes long and I don't want to go over ten minutes. So I'm going to put some Mod Podge on here, which is going to seal my stone, my rhinestones and my lettering and everything. So I'm going to put some of this matte Mod Podge on there. And then I'll be done. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And here is my wall hanging Valentine's decor. Thanks for watching. Have a good night.